Seriously, I see Teslas on the news all the time. It can't be that good, man. Wait, I'm gonna be on YouTube. Hell yeah. Can I do another video with you, maybe? Man, that's the emergency. Man, that's the emergency release button, man. Tesla videos. I know how to open this thing. Awesome. Alright, let's hook this up to the Bluetooth here. Let me see. Okay. Alright. What the hell do you think you're doing? How did you unlock the car? Well, about that. Mm, never mind. What do you want, Ken? I thought I got a rear view. Why well, you gotta be like that? I mean, no harm, and you're not crazy. I've been watching you, and it's our channel. It's growing some. First of all, remove those glasses, man. You look like a geek. And second, it's my channel, not our channel. Jeez, okay. <laughs> You're so weird. You just <laughs> called yourself weird, you know. Yeah, whatever. So what's up? I'm recording a video right now. <laughs> right on time. So I notice you have full self-driving beta now? I sure do. Well, don't you think that is kind of dangerous, and Tesla releasing it to the public like that when it's in beta? Are you saying I can't pay attention and monitor the car while driving? No, <laughs> no, I'm not saying that. Just saying it could be dangerous if one person doesn't pay attention and possibly injure someone. You are one curious clone. I swear you sound like all the other people who wants full self-driving to fail. I don't mean to sound like that, but you have to admit that it is a little dangerous. But one, but what precaution is Tesla taking to make they make sure they pick the right Well, people? look above that rearview mirror right there. You see that? I never even noticed that camera. Well, that really helps them monitor us and make sure we are paying attention to the road. If we get so many strikes, they'll remove us from the beta program. Can someone trick that, possibly? People trick everything, probably. But that's why software updates and improving the beta program is very important. Okay, fair point. But what did you do to get in the beta program? Look at the screenshot I took. They have a safety score program that monitors certain driving factors and it gives you a score after each drive. Since I received a 100 safety score, after 500 plus miles, I was in the first batch to receive the public beta program. They're carefully releasing it to lower scores right now and even Canada soon. That's pretty cool. Anything else? You still have the autopilot nag that checks every so often to make sure you're still there as well. So, can I drive it to work for a few days? Are you serious? Yes. Okay. Really? Hell no. Calm down. Why not? You, ne you never let me drive your car. It's nothing to play with. It's serious. You really have to pay attention, and you might get me a strike for not paying attention or something. You don't trust me? I'll trust you if I'm in a car with you, and I'm not too fond of you. Why not? You're knowing with all the questions. Go focus on the other EV brands. Well, always Tesla. Because they are always on the news when something happens. Exactly my point. You listen to the fake news, like I told you on our last video. But the administration says GM is leaving, leading the EV charge and never mentions Tesla. What EV company do you really think is pushing things for? Tesla, clearly. Exactly.
I forgot you paid twelve thousand dollars for full self driving. It's twelve thousand dollars. <laughs> no, I paid eight thousand dollars for mine. Yeah, it's a steep price. That's another conversation I have. I just wish it was transferable software. I respect that. But really, how is full self driving beta? It's pretty good. I really have to pay attention to ensure I'm safe and everyone around me is safe. It's getting better though. That's so cool. But before I go, why did not I get as many views as dad did when you made that video with him? Somehow that video hit the YouTube algorithm and just took off. My dad is way cooler than you are. Our dad. Negative. My dad. You were made up for entertainment that I can use to say whatever I need to say to prove a point. And you're free. Sorry. Ouch. That hurts. You're alright though. At least you're more open about Tesla and not just bashing them. You are really curious and I appreciate wow, that. Wow, first compliment. <laughs> I'll let you get back to your video. I'll see you sometime soon. Duh, you are the video. But yeah, don't forget to press the button to get out this time and not the emergency release. I'll remember it this time. I'm thinking this time about ordering me one. Gas prices are so high and I'm tired of paying $80 at the pump for my truck. Just think about it. It's not for everyone and gas prices will not be high all the time, but it saves you money in other ways as well. You take care and thanks you for making me feel like I have an imaginary friend that looks like me. You're very welcome. Oh yeah, before I go, can I do the closing on the video? Just this one time, please. Yeah, do you know it? Yeah, I think I remember. You'll be very proud of me. Okay, everyone, this will be our closing. Take it away, man. Please hit that like button and hit that subscribe button if you see fit. And also hit that notification bell as it will notify you when I do post new videos. This is YouTube Ken. I'll see you in the next video. Damn, that was perfect, man.